Lorraine Kelly, 62, has shared her heartbreak over Queen Elizabeth II's corgis as the royal dogs awaited the arrival of her funeral procession at Windsor Castle. The TV presenter took to Twitter to share two heartwarming pictures of the Her Majesty's corgis as she lamented they will be bereft. Sharing a tweet by Twitter user Elliot Waglang, Lorraine wrote, Poor wee things will be bereft. The photos showed the two corgis sitting on the grounds of the castle as the cortege made its way toward them. The young corgis, one on a red lead and one on a blue lead, were accompanied by two pages in red tail coats. However, Lorraine was not the only one sharing her concerns about the Queen's corgis, as other Twitter users shared their thoughts in her replies. Mom's helper one said, hopefully they are getting extra pets and snuggles. Gaspin added, those dogs' faces they miss her. Sick, Kate Henning 15 tweeted, her beautiful horse too. Other social media users shared similar views on the Queen's beloved horse, Emma. Queen's loyal corgis Mick and Sandy wait patiently for their owner one last time the Queen's beloved corgis made a poignant appearance this afternoon as their owner was brought to her final resting place in Windsor after the state funeral. Read about the touching moment Mick and Sandy were led out, as the procession with the late monarch's coffin made its way to St. George's Chapel. Beans 2809 penned, oh! The Queen's Pony Emma, standing to see hashtag Queen Elizabethii for the last time her two great passions weren't people. They were animals. Hashtag dogs and hashtag horses Rob Davidson 74 typed, well that got me. And the late Queen's favorite horse, a fell pony named hashtag Emma out on parade to oversee her final return to hashtag Windsor Castle. Hashtag Emma Hashtag Queen's Funeral Hashtag Queen Elizabeth I Hashtag Queen Elizabeth ITV News Royal Editor Chris Ship remarked, moving moment for Terry Pendry who went riding often with the Queen. He stands on Cambridge Drive at Windsor Castle with a dismounted horse and bows his head as the state hearse passes in front Hashtag Queen Elizabeth Hashtag Funeral Many of the Queen's dogs were descended from her first corgi, Susan, who was a present for her 18th birthday in 1944. The corgi community was left heartbroken by the monarch's death on September 8. K. Hogg, secretary of the Welsh Corgi League Scottish sector, said, We are very, very sad. Everywhere the Queen went there were always corgis. She grew up with corgis and everybody associated corgis with the Queen. We feel as though, although there is a corgi league and a society, we've actually lost part of our world. She did so much for the breed always had corgis by her side all her life.